It's not uncommon for the American Red Cross to notice a decrease in blood donors over the summer months, but this year there are concerns about just how small the supply is getting. Sarah Winkleman has more. Since the 4th of July weekend, the American Red Cross is in an emergency appeal, meaning that they are asking anyone who is willing and able to give blood to head to the nearest donation center. Make sure that we ensure that there is blood on the shelves for the patients in need. Um, you know, we don't want to get to the point where they're canceling surgeries because there just isn't blood available. The blood shortage has not gotten to that point yet, but the trend for donating this summer is lower than it should be. We usually do see in an appeal in the summertime, but this one is very scary um, as it's so low. So we're just trying to get the word out and try to get people to come in and donate. For now, doctors must get special approval to receive certain blood types. We still do need permission to ask for additional type O blood, both Rh positive and negative, uh, to get, come into our inventory. Even though nationally the Red Cross is facing a blood shortage, donors in central Minnesota are very reliable in times of need. I think we are the luckiest. We have such great donors, especially in the Brainerd Lakes area. Um, they're very loyal and they are responding. The signups for that drive are increasing daily by lots of numbers, so that's great. And um, so we just are seeing the trend of them, everybody wanting to help out. The efforts from local donors that continue to come out and help the cause have not gone unnoticed. I'm comfortable that we are going to have a supply. Um, American Red Cross uh, is very, they, they've actually written us letters saying, wow, you guys are great. Thanks for doing such a good job getting donors. Um, so they recognize that, that we are trying to help them supply uh, other people as well. The next community blood drive is on July 28th at the National Guard Armory in Brainerd, where people are already beginning to sign up in order to fill the need. It's nice to be a part of a community like this that really supports everyone. Reporting in Brainerd, Sarah Winkleman, Lakeland News. The Red Cross is expecting a large need of blood donations all the way through August. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.